There was a time when all I did was sing Scottish <coughs> folk songs. And I saw that that market was even more limited than that of the song singer-songwriter. <laughs> and uh, so the reason I used to do all that is because my heritage is Scottish. And I was, uh, you know, I was one of the 10 pound migrants coming out as a two year old. So, uh, <laughs> but of course I went back a couple of times and we spent some time in school, so I got to know the place. And I wondered why it is that I like like singing and music and all this thing, and because uh, nobody in my family really does. And uh, anyway, I went back into, you know, where does this come from? Where the genes to sing, want to sing come from? And I had a great granny who was a wedding singer in Stornoway in the Western Hebrides of Scotland. So we went to Stornoway, didn't we? We did. And I think she would have sung this song. So that's why it's in the bracket. Just as to break things up a little bit, this is a a song that was written by a Robert Tannehill, uh, who was a poet post Burns, the Romantic era in Scotland. <coughs> and of course, it's, you'd be pleased to know it's in English. That's the good news. The bad news is it's in Scottish English, okay? <laughs> so you might be struggling a little bit to understand what it's all about. There's going to be a test afterwards, by the way. So here this is called Gloomy Winter is New A War, which means. It means gloomy, you know what that means. Uh, winter, we know what that means, especially in Scotland. We, in fact, we can feel it almost, can't we? Is new or war it means it's nearly gone, thank goodness. And uh, now we can move on to more important things like spring and chasing girls, which is what the song's all about. Gloomy winter's new or Soft the westland breezes blow in the bugs of Stanley Shaw The labour sings for cheerio Sweet the crop flowers early bell Text to Lenny first you we tell Bloom and make your body sell May my darling dear you Come my lassie
joy to me. Can I bring? 